guys, we're going to do this uh, patriotic tiger design. First, you're going to start by uh, stippling some white over the eyes and over the mouth for the muzzle. I used the tag pearl white on these because I really wanted it to be shiny. And put that over the eyes and over the mouth. And then using a split cake of whatever patriotic colors you like, you're just going to fill that in in between the white from the eyes, over the nose, and then over the cheek area down to the muzzle. So just keep stippling that on and go under the eye and just bring it on down around to the bottom of the mouth so you get the color evenly distributed the way you want. Make sure you get all your lines showing. Now I'm using a number four low canal round and a tag regular dark blue. You're just going to come across the nose, press and pull and lift up, kind of like a Mark Reed stroke to do your first tiger lines by the eyes. And then you're going to do a little point by the tear duct, bring it up and over the eyelid, meet that first tiger stripe, and then fill in the eyelid. And then you're going to bring it up and flick it on the sides, kind of like a... Uh, exaggerated cat eye when you do eyeliner. And do that same technique on the other side. Using a star stencil and um, just regular tag white and a sponge, pretty dry, you're just going to use your variations and fill in some stars on one side of the forehead. And then over by the sides of the eyes, and then again on the other side by the bottoms on the eyes. This is a kind of a Mark Reed technique. It's to bring it in on the tip, push, drag, and turn. Really fine points on the tips. And this is, um, again, a lot of this is inspired by Mark Reed techniques. And this is uh, his kind of his cat nose. Around the sides of the nose, bring it up and press, and then just fill it in. Then you're going to outline the bottoms of the eyes and meet it with your outside points. And now we're going to do some more tiger stripes. Press, wiggle, and then lift up. Remember, you want your points to be really sharp. I'm going to do, sorry guys, I forgot I should go ahead and do my muzzle. That way I kind of have a gauge where I want my lines to be. So you're just going to bring it out to the sides, press, and then bring it around. Again, tip, press, twist on the tip again. And then darken these up. On the tip, press down, wiggle, twist, bring it back up onto the tip. Tip, press, wiggle, twist, bring it up on the tip. Again on the tip, press, wiggle, twist, bring it up on the tip. Again on the tip, press, wiggle, twist, bring it up on the tip. And then your last one in here, press, wiggle, bring it up on the tip. And then you can just give like a little fine outline to your stars. I would personally recommend really doing just one side on each one of the star points. And you can leave your design like this if you wanted to save time. And now we're going to do the little split between the nose and the lip. Bring it all the way down in between. And then you're just going to connect those little push marks on the sides from your muzzle to your center lip. And it's just kind of right underneath the mouth. Now this is another Mark Reed technique. And it's kind of the scalloping muzzle motion. You're just going to press real hard, wiggle, and then bring it in up on the tip. And do that on both sides. And you're just going to bring down, press, wiggle, twist, and bring it in. Press, wiggle, twist, bring it in. Now let's do some more underneath the eyes, because this is where we're going to put our glitter. Again, it's just on the tip. Press it, wiggle, and then on the tip. Now you want to fill this in with just some regular white. If you do like I did with the first time on this design and use a light pearl color, it won't show up. 
so you want to make sure that you use regular white. And then you're just going to dip into some water, have kind of a semi-damp um, brush, and you're just going to roll the glitter on. Again, right underneath the eye, in between those two lines, and just roll glitter on. It really makes it pop. It looks nice that way. Very firecracky. <laughs> That's a word. Now we're going to do our teeth. She loves teeth. <laughs> Now we're going to take some red and fill in our bottom lip. Again, you're going to see a lot of Mark Reed inspired ideas here. I'm going to put glitter, red glitter on that. This is really going to make it sparkle. The whole design is built around kind of like a 4th of July fireworks concept. Now we're going to use that same regular dark blue by tag and we're going to outline our teeth and outline our bottom lip. Again, still using the number four round through the whole design. Now using some uh, Mark Reed, Muron, Liquid Bling, and White, I just kind of go over the stars because I really wanted to give it a really shiny and three-dimensional feel. Again, over every other tiger stripe. I'm going to outline those. And now with the red, same product, we're going to outline every other one in red. And there you have it. Happy 4th of July, guys.